particularly well, so that could end up being a big statistic this evening. The starting five for USC. Who helps out Juju Watkins, who's been the leading scorer in 19? And on the outlet, she is on the move, and she's playing downhill most of the game. There she is, and it's blocked by Pueyo. Pueyo is a member of the All-Pac-12 defensive team last year. Practice her expression never changes. It's all business out there. She doesn't hang her head. She moves on to the next play. And Pueyo has made back-to-back -back plays. They do not have a deep bench. In fact, only eight are suiting up tonight here in L.A. Shot clock's winding down. They get the touch inside and one for Caitlin Davis. Tonight they are firmly on the three seed line, which would mean they could play at home first and second rounds here in the NCAA tournament. Switch sides of the floor in transition. Now you watch a lot of film on her. She comes up the right side. She's very right hand dominant. And she keeps the ball on the right side. Cleo yeah, knows yeah. that. Good D by Caitlin Davis. Getting back in transition. That was Sky Jones on the drive. Watkins weaving, looking for an opening. Hangs and hits. Surfers bucket. Watkins, a slow start for the All-American candidate. What Splitter time in, in L.A. and up in the valley between a couple of high schools the last couple of years at Sierra Canyon. Cuello stays in the game with two fouls and knocks down the jump. Here is Gilbert, number 15 in blue. Find some space at the elbow, and she'll knock down her first shot of the night. Doesn't even have any sweat going yet. Instead of, you know, moving the ball and playing off the pass, and there's off, no pass in a shot. Offensive rebound, and the stick back for Isis Bay. I thought they were fantastic on the offensive rebounding. They had seven offensive boards. Gilbert takes her on the switch. Juju gives it up. Reach side rebound. That'll take care of the first quarter. At Virginia and Louisiana Tech, a rich history over the last four decades. Three ball on its way and good. Kayla Padilla, the grad student, back home in Southern Cal really hedging on those ball screens right now. Now they're changing what they do, coming off the timeout. And then they're back on top by one. Hand in a passing lane and a turnover. This is their game. Steal and score it before you can set up your D. Gilbert on the run. In with the bigs off the board. She's had an impact. She's had a couple of buckets already, and then she's been very good in their man-to-man -man or in their jump as Juju lets it fly from deep. Gilbert, nice use of the screen. Bodies up a defender and off the backboard again. Really good, no call. The pick, the roll, and another picked off pass. Gilbert with the push. Watkins back defensively. And the swap. Here's Juju. See, there's the switch off that I'm talking about. See, Puello, oh, man, she just blows by. Wow, what a move. Right foot, left foot, right foot, wrong foot. Puello, remember, has two. So she gets bumped off in that. Evens the score. Live over the top. Nice catch. And the lay-in for Cunningham. Really well executed. Uh, out in the parks playing ball since she was about seven years old. Jumper's good. Jones, give her three. Good ball movement. That's what USC needs. Other contributors, Taylor Bigby. Big B, much taller in this matchup, and look at the space. Scramble for the loose ball, a good break for Jones, and she'll take it all the way in. Switches to the right hand for the lefty. Geiler Jones, Beth, hits the triple, then comes up with a loose change right here, and drives it right. USC number 10 in the country. Their net rank is 16. They have five top 25 wins. That's amongst the most in the country. I love when coaches try to go back door off timeouts. Williams on the inbound. Another offensive rebound. And there's the stick back for Martinez. And you know what? It's allowed them to get the lead. I wouldn't come out of it no. until it's working. 
Now that could try and loosen it up a little bit. Kayla Padir, her second triple, she's got nine. She has 12 points, all on triples. She's got five assists to go with it. And Beth, she's only had three turnovers in the last. Cuello gets into the paint and a pull up is He's good. Got a smooth game as well. Approaching two minutes to go here in the first half. I mean, look at Williams just draped all over Juju. And Juju's not even in the play. She's going, okay, you want to play face guard me? Then they're going to play four on four. And that's pretty much what they've done. Now the three balls starting to fall. I think Rebecca Lobo broke the seal talking about it in the studio. Watkins, nice drop off, and the lay-in is good for Akun Wafo. Fifteen foot, it won't go another offensive rebound and a stick back. Telling everybody to clear out of the right side. See, she doesn't like screens in this situation. She'll take it, steps through, and one. But she's going to wiggle her way back to that right hand. Look at the explosiveness. Steps around the defender, keeps her eyes up, and finishes high off the glass. USC 10th in the country, and they're trying to stay in the thick of the chase in the Pac-12, and an outstanding block right there from Caitlin Davis. Charlie Brackett's project seven. Pac-12 teams can get in. With Cal right now on the bubble. Jada Williams staying in that matchup with Juju Watkins. Oh, nice ball fake. And there is the picture perfect pull up. On 17 shots, she's 10 for 10 on from the free throw line. Williams spins around. Padillo gets the block. This uh, team should have a. Different look next year when they make the move to the Big 12. Juju gets a block. Another good looking freshman, Scott. She's more of a passer on the left side, Beth, but she always pass it and go back and get it. 15 footer is good. Caitlin Davis. Watkins and USC expected to be on that list. The kick out, second chance, got it. Padilla's fourth triple of the night. Yeah, Padilla, you shoot till your arm falls off. Caleb. Who went out with an injury. Martinez knocks it down. Yeah, Martinez, I'm asking her to, to get going, right? I mean, she's a, a player for them that can shoot it. You got to really stay down in a stance. You can't take all her shiftiness. Look at that curl right there, so she forces a switch. That is a beautiful play right there by Juju Watkins. Watch Juju on this curl right here. Oh, Cueo able to knock it away. Here comes Arizona on the run. Martinez out in front. Steal, score. Juju against the double. They find the open shooter, Padilla, got it! Oh, oh, oh. That's her fifth! Yeah, Padilla! She steps into it! They like this Juju off this floppy action. To the left hand, count it! Caitlin Davis! To pull away here in the third. Juju picked up the dribble. Spinning inside, and there's Marshall. First field goal. Williams, she's to the window. She's going to be really good for Adia Barnes. On Caitlin Davis. Look at Jada. Juju spins. Marshall blocked. Jones got that one. Williams, deep three, no. And it's tipped right to Martinez, who has hit five triples. She also has six assists. 
Yeah, I really like Martinez's game, and I think she's starting to come on. We're calling for her to get going. Looking for turnovers and quick buckets to get back into this, and Graham Marshall running the floor. Got up to the rim on that one. Nice little finger roll. Offensive rebound. Jones blocked and a foul. But if that's on Juju, or they're going to call that a block. 6 through the team. From behind, Juju gets the block, I believe. Padilla, nice drop off, and another assist. That's number seven. Good decision maker, as we mentioned before. She hasn't turned the ball over. She's having one of her best nights. I know Coach Vandeveer didn't like that. You know, Coach Vandeveer said her, that uh, she watched a lot of film to get ready, you know, like she always does. Marshall, good position. Big fourth quarter continues. Oh, good well, another good steal. She'll try and go coast to coast. This time she was good. She's got some game, right? Ooh. A little sloppy on the inbound. And Watkins cleans it up. She turns it over and then she swats it out of bounds. You like this clear? They got a smaller player on her. Got to stay down. Juju takes her. Nice little fade. And a 72-57 USC lead. Watkins. You got to try to force her back into help. Back to her left hand. But she wants to get to that right. And there's Williams. Watkins able to track it down. Left alone for three. And she hits. You know, she was out here today making shots before shoot around. Courtney Paris at OU, Maya Moore and Paige Beckers at Connecticut. It is a rarity. And the possibility there might be a couple this season. As we mentioned earlier, it's only happened one time that both schools got to host NCAA tournament games. And that's where they're headed right now. I think that's important for them moving forward. Another steal by Quayle. Can't get it the first time. Gilbert does the second time, and a foul on Juju. They've got the easiest schedule remaining of the contenders in the league, with just one remaining ranked foe. That's Oregon State. And oh, what a move by Juju to put.